Hi guys, this is a review of the Brave Stablemates Roll and Go Western playset. I've not actually had one of these ones before. It seems quite well packaged. It's obviously you've got lots of information on the back. You get a little pouch with it where you can put all the accessories which actually come with it. It's quite a good idea really. I mean, it says all about it. The horse is apparently called Chief. Seems like a little books buckskin horse. You get a little cow, dog, you get your mat, which is also the bag as well. You get a corral and a water trough by the look of it. So, right, get into it. That was easy. Oops, hold on. There's a mat. Some fence panels. Put them there. We have a trough and hopefully I will be able to get into the rest of it without breaking it too much. Ah, here we are. I should have got some scissors for this, but I didn't. The thing is with Brea they always tack everything down really quite well so you don't get any damages in while it's being transit. Oops, there we go. And there we have a little doggy, a border collie. Oops, we have a mini moo. I'll be more careful with the horse. And there he is. He's called Chief, I think they said he was called. Right, and let's try this. Threw that on the floor. The thing is with Brea stuff, it always does seem really quite well made. So, what we will do, get everyone sorted out. Oh, a nice little ribbon. How sweet. And there we go, we've got loads of different pouches for all the little bits. And there's your little play set. Hold it flat. There you go, your horse is running through the corral. A little cow escaping. Hope you can see it. There you go. Got a little doggy to help you. There's a, a bucket, and these are held on with the little plastic wires, which Brea is so well known for. And I don't know how they tie them so tightly, but they always manage it very, very well. I can't even undo this. Get in there eventually. Do, 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 do. Yes, anyway. How on earth have they done that? <laughs> Sorry about this. Still trying to unwind them. Here we go. I think I've just cut my finger, actually. Yep, I've just cut my finger on the wire. Child friendly. There you go. And these fences all clipped together. Not like that. There we go. These are upside down, obviously. Go that way around. And this satin. It's kind of cool. Got another set. Which go? That way around. Obviously, you clip on the other sides. And the other bit falls off. There you go. Got a nice little corral. For your cow, your dog, well, your dog don't go in it. Mm, the horse has got a friend. Whoops. Apparently they're all drunk. There we go. And that is what you get with the uh, 
what was it? The Roll and Go Western playset. And best of all, you can take it to bits really quickly. Turn this over and you put all your bits and your accessories inside. Do, do, do. Yes, you do. And we're getting there. And the horse who doesn't actually fit in the pouch. Ah, I think I've got this the wrong way around actually. Horses go in there. I guess all the fences are meant to go in the small bits at the top. There you go. I'm going to wrap it up. Not very well, apparently. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Oh, cow down. Well, there you go. Not quite impressed with the wrapping. Looked a lot better than it was, but there you go. That has been the Roll and Go Western Playset by Breya. It is actually very good quality, so I am not, you know, giving it a bad review or anything like that. It's just obviously I've got all the bits in the wrong order, so it won't roll up as nicely as it did originally. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you'll subscribe, and I'll see you next time.